Hello again ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another episode of The Sims 4. We are following the family of the Wins plus Kaylee Liss who is a de facto part of the Wynn family because she happens to be married to Silver. Now we caught Silver right here at near midnight, in fact it is midnight, slightly past midnight, building herself a rocket right outside of the Arid Manor. Now I'm pretty sure building a rocket at this distance away from the wall is probably going to leave some scorch marks. Can, well, if it, you know, decides to fire. But Kay, uh, not Kaylee, Silver just actually managed to gain herself another skill point. Let's go and check what this skill point was. She reached level 3 in rocket science. She can now expand fuel tank storage for rockets. Okay. Then I... Um, you are still building, and let's go and take a look at this. You are still uncomfortable because of that microwave meal that you had. Well, you know, Silver, that'll go away in time. Your next meal is probably going to be... is probably going to be, um, oven cooked. Let's go and check to see what Amethyst is doing. Amy is going to go for an endurance run. In fact, Amy, because you happen to be so healthy, why don't you go and prepare yourself, or the entire family, or household, why don't you go and prepare, I don't know, some taco casserole? Taco casserole? I don't know. Let's go and do that. I've never actually had taco and I'm not a fan of casserole in reality. Oh my god, why can't I say that word? And I'm not, I'm not a fan of casserole in reality either. But that might be because I've been exposed to casseroles with flavours that I didn't really like. So we can see here Amethyst is expertly putting in some salt and then expertly walking along and placing this thing into a microwave. Not a microwave tray, an oven tray. Um, what was that? Silver, are you okay? Really, your clothing hasn't been destroyed or even had any suit go onto it. You are a really effective builder of a rocket, you know. You are currently thinking about a one-eyed cyclops monster. <laughs> I'd be pretty surprised if it was a two-eyed cyclops monster. Oh my god, Silver. This rocket that you're building, really? This is, this is really big. I mean, it's a rocket. Yeah, I know it's meant to be really big. But seriously, Silver. Like, you just, you just started this thing. I'm pretty sure people who start studying rocket science don't go out there and immediately, you know, build a rocket. And Silver, she's doing everyone very proud. She's doing this entire house, household proud. She just managed to build a rocket on her first try. Now she's thinking about how to deflect the harmful UV rays from the sun. And also the solar winds. Oh my god, now she has envisioned the image of the world. What is this? Now she's envisioned the image of, um, that would set, I don't know, was that even a planet on our, in our solar system? Is this place even, oh my god, Silver, don't do that, you scare me every time. Is this planet even Earth? Like, is the sun actually called the sun or is it another star? It might be in a completely different universe. Um... Amethyst, what are you doing? Can you go and assist with this? Oh my god, Amethyst is actually going to be able to assist with this. Wow. So here we have Amethyst Win and Silver Win both working on this rocket. Let's go and um, tell an unbelievable story while we do so. Game is frozen again, but that it'll take a while to come back. There we go. Let's see. Can you even multitask here? I don't think... No, these sims aren't multitasking. Why would you multitask when building a rocket? I mean, surely that's probably... That was a large bang. But surely, multitasking when building a rocket is only a recipe for demise, I assume. Meanwhile, Charles is still asleep and so is Kaylee. Let's go and take a look at when they're... Next. Oh my god, Kaylee, you need to go and do something about your needs. Um, use that. Uh -huh. Play in the jets. Um, and then go and grab yourself a... Let me first put that in the fridge. And then go and grab yourself a taco casserole. 
I think tacos are also a American thing, if I'm not mistaken. We don't get tacos over here in regularity. Like, you can't go to a British um, restaurant and ask for a taco. They'll, they'll be like, dude, you're in the wrong country. Um, although we do, I'm pretty sure there are, like, tacos do exist over here. It's just not something that is a part of our culture, or something that's developed in our culture. So, Kaylee, did you... Wow. She... Okay, her hygiene is a little bit up. Not as much as I expected to be. Oh, and by the way, there's a kid's room here if you guys haven't noticed. There's also a sim out here doing random push-ups. Who are you? I'm pretty sure that there is Bella Goth. Yep, that is indeed Bella Goth. And who is this? I do not know who this lady is. Carissa Griffith. Wow, you're, you know, kind of fat. I hope you um, get what you want out of your exercise. Oh my god, like, early morning is a perfect time for people to go out jogging. Who are these two people? You are Zest Johnny, and you are Bailey Wang. Okay. I'm not going to make any sort of jokes about that name. Oh my Rumors. god, the rocket is done! Really? <gasps> wow. Well, you know what we have to do now, right? Kaylee. Kaylee, <laughs> are you with me for this? Kaylee looks like she's very much enjoying her taco casserole. Drink a shalbo. And Silver is, oh, you know, she's a little bit Just hungry. Amethyst ben starts work in one hour. I kind of want to send her to work early, but I know that's probably not oh. a thing that ah. can be done. Kaylee, hurry up and finish your meal. We have to do this. This has to be done. Okay, Kaylee. Excellent. Go and um, wash up your plates. Great. And now, we need to go and do this. Woohoo with Silver Wind in the spaceship! Sorry, space rocket. Or rocket, just rocket. Um, Amethyst, you probably don't want to be here for this. I'm pretty sure that's not something that lies within your interest. How do they even enter the rocket? Oh my god, they're in... <laughs> Holy crap! It's taking off! Whoa. Okay. That's a thing. And it's very definitely a thing. Where the heck did they get astronaut outfits from? What the heck? Is it going to come back down? Amethyst is off to work. Good luck, Amethyst. Go and make some connections. Um, are you guys going to come back down eventually? I'm pretty sure you guys are having a whale of a time up there, but I miss you guys already. I mean, come on. Guys? Guys? Fine, whatever. So here is um, Charles. Charles is. Does he have work today? Oolong. He has work in 10 hours. A storm of flame. Okay, Charles, once you've done that, go and. Um, let's go and write a song. Let's go and write a, a jaunty strain. I don't even know what a jaunty strain is, but let's go and do that. In the meanwhile, I'm going to position my camera like this so I can see when the rock comes. Oh, there we go. Successfully woohoo in a rocket ship. 50 Mile High Club, I think it was called. Yep, 50 Mile High Club. I'm pretty sure 50 miles upwards... I, I don't know miles, in fact. I have no idea. It could very well be up in space. Let's go and check. 50 Mile High Club. There's nothing like your first time in space, but subsequent times are still pretty fantastic. I'd say that's pretty extraordinary. I mean, you guys have had next to no training. You guys, you know, just put together the rocket, and all of a sudden you guys are out into space. And you managed to land correctly as well. With all of the original parts of the rocket ship. That is amazing. 
These guys, guys, like viewers, I think we have something amazing going on between these sims. I think Silver has just proven herself once more as the intelligent person, or the most intelligent sim in this entire household. Sure, she had a little bit of help from Amethyst, and that is not to go unnoticed. Threat Report Amy's got a big report on a new emerging threat due tomorrow at work, but she's swamped. She can either secretly ask for help from another researcher, or work all night to get it done. What should she do? Hmm. Work all night? Let's go and ask for help. The other researcher does a stellar job, and Amethyst promises to cover for him when he's in a pinch. Amethyst's bosses are com are pleased. Are compleased? Compleased is not a word. But over here we have... Um, Charles, here just bowing for inspiration. He's actually pretty good. You know, I've mentioned this several times, but if I ever had to, or if I ever was given the opportunity to learn any instrument, I would definitely pick the violin. I know it's also one of the most difficult ones to play because it's, um, oh, I have this musical friend who I speak to on a regular basis, or semi-regular basis, who told me that it's a different type of instrument than, say, a guitar or a piano. I think it was something to do with if you... It's harder to make the violin sound nicer than those other instruments, so that's why it's a bit different. Um, you know, Silver, you could probably get out of your space suit while you're eating dinner or lunch. Sorry, this is still breakfast. Now you want to go and practice speaking in the mirror, plant something, and tell a joke. Do we have... Um, we don't. Let's go into our collections tab. That's not the collections tab. Um, here we go. And can we go and purchase some seeds? We can't do that? Can we do it from the phone menu? Find a job, hire a service. Uh, no. Oh, I know where we have to do it from. We have to do it from the computer. Let's go over to the computer and go more options, more choices. Order. Um, order seeds. Let's go for some. What should we go for? Starter flowers, fruits, herbs, or vegetables. Out of all of these, the one that sounds most appealing to me, honestly, the fruits. So let's go for two packs of fruits. And it appears in our inventory immediately. The order, the online ordering system in The Sims is actually pretty efficient. I mean, it was like within the minute delivery. And there's no even, there's not even actual delivery man that comes by and delivers it, so you don't have to like worry that you're gonna miss him or anything. Let's go and open the seed packet in the library. Why don't we? Uh, did you open it? Oh yeah, you did open it. Let's go and open this one as well. You got some... Plantain. A starchy banana-like fruit best cooked before eating. Why didn't they just give us a banana fruit or anything? Hmm, I'm tempted to... Place some of the... Um, things. Some planters. A planter around here. Oh, what's this? Oh my god, you can change... You can change these? Wow! That's like... I didn't know you could do that. What about... Over here? Okay, these ones don't require any trimming at all. Um, Silver, you have to get out of your spacesuit. I mean, it's just... Not very... Good. Let's go for everyday one. Um, and also I need to, you know, get rid of the lipstick that you're wearing because you look kind of stupid in your everyday outfit with your lipstick. Um, what am I needing to go for? Try and change appearance, that's what I need. And while down here, Charles is still having a bunch of fun playing his instrument. Let's see, he's not even a quarter way through his song. But here we go, and we're entering into the creator sim thing. Just watch as the thing goes round and round, or sorry, diamond by diamond, Fanship diamond to diamond. Delaney. And one other thing as well, because I told Silver to go and um, change her appearance in the mirror, 
I now have access to everybody's appearance for some bizarre reason. Don't ask me why. I can even change their clothes. Yep, can easily change the clothes. Okay, Silver, so let's change your lipstick. Now, I don't want you to wear no lipstick. I want you to wear something that um, makes your lips look a little bit darker, or maybe even a little bit lighter. I think those actually, that actually looks quite good, but in fact, is that the one that Kaylee wears? No, Kaylee wears that one. Yeah, Kaylee's lips are different. Her ones shine a bit more. Um, but there's got to be some other one in here. Uh, da -da -da -da. I might just go for one of these two. Let's go and check in this one. There's black. Oh my god, that looks so silly. Black lipstick can actually look really good if you pull the style off correctly, but it doesn't look good on her, you know, dressed up as basically a housewife. That's basically what she's dressed up as. Um... No, 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 no. Okay, so it's got to be this one then. One of these two. I'll just stick with this one because it looks the least like she's trying to put on lipstick to try and make herself look, I don't know, um, physically pleas pleasing or something like that. I don't know. But it like also has a difference between... It makes a difference between her having lipstick and her not having lipstick. So I'm going to stick with that. Let's just go and take that. And I'm not even going to focus on the other um, Sims in the household's appearance yet. Because I think they look perfectly fine. Okay, admittedly Charles needs to do a bit more exercise. So that's probably going to have to change as well. I also need to get... Um, Charles a romantic interest as well. Silver and Kaylee are already married, so them finding a romantic interest out in the wild is probably a little bit shunned upon. And Amethyst, well, we all know what Amethyst is like. We've all seen what she does and how she breaks up with people. In fact, I don't even know if that was actually on the... Um, your build has just been delivered. I don't, oh my god! 15,939 simoleons? Wow! How much did I earn, like, last time? I'm just off to work. Um, the previous day I earned... How much did I even earn? 200, 200... Wow, like, under 500. Okay, not under 500. And that'll be 540. That's... Not a lot. So let's go and have Silver go and pay the bills. I know you just entered into a gaming tournament or whatever. Okay, Charles. You've really got to learn when you need to stop playing and start attending to your basic needs. Like, I really wouldn't play a violin or a musical instrument long enough for me to nearly be bursting. Has to pee. Charles needs to go to the bathroom soon. Becomes really has to pee in two hours. He becomes really has to pee. That is kind of hilarious, in fact. Okay, so, Silver, what are you doing? You are going to get a kiss from Kaylee. Okay. Let's go and check to see how much um, satisfaction you guys have. Kaylee has... Nearly 3,000 satisfaction. Silver has 4,000 satisfaction. So let's go and check to see some of the things that we can get for her. Wow, she can get anything apart from never weary because she basically had that already. Let's see, hardly hungry. They don't have as much as an appetite. Savant. Gains all skills much faster. Super green thumb will find out the plants they garden have amazing vitality. I don't know what that exactly means. Fertile, that's probably not something that Silver should obtain, unless females can start reproducing with other females. Carefree, antiseptic, beguiling, beguiling, what's that? Anyone can, they can put anyone in a flirty mood with just one look. Okay, steel bladder looks nice. Observant, in The Sims 3, observant was always the first trait that I got. 
simply because it's so useful. Um, but since we have 4,000 satisfaction, let's go and obtain Hardly Hungry. This way, Silver can focus more on her intellectual pursuits. Oh yeah, and I also completely forgot about everyone's lifetime ambition. Oh my god, this guy. Jalen Dominguez. Dominguez? Dominguez. Um, let's go and do a cheerful introduction. He looks really upset. Let's try and, you know, try and calm him down. He really doesn't want to be calmed down, does he? He is angry. Why the heck is he even angry? Uh, let's go and share brilliant ideas. And let's go for... Oh, you're introducing yourself now. <laughs> Apparently Silver already knew this dude. Let's go for a deep conversation. I also apologize if the sound of the fountain is really making you want to, you know, um, become really has to pee. But that's just what happens when you converse out near, well, the fountain. Um, let's see. Jo joke about old times. Kaylee, firstly, you are not old. You are still considered to be a young adult. Secondly, you just introduced yourself to this person. How could you joke about old times? Unless you're really talking about old times, like when, I don't know, um, you know, America was first founded and everything was all in monotone, black and white, or maybe even some grey. But Charles is now awake, or stopped doing whatever it is that he was doing. And he is going to go and grab a serving. I promise, Charles, you'll have your episode soon. Just not yet. Your ep your work is going to start in four hours. Four hours is not enough time for an episode, I'm afraid, Charles. That is really not enough time. There we go. Okay, guys, I'll be back in one second. Just going to check the time on this episode. And we're back. We still have a few... Um, a few more minutes left, so let's continue on. Now, there's something about this seating arrangement over here that just doesn't really... It's not striking my fancy. Like, I have an image in my head, but I can't define what the image is. And this seating, or this, like, area over here doesn't really fulfill that seating. Or, not that seating. It fulfills everyone's seating needs, unless there's way more sim than can fit on this thing. But it doesn't really fulfill the image I have in my head quite well. So let's go and... Okay, the game is actually pausing quite a lot. I'm kind of getting a bit um, nervous about it. Oh, and I've never really shown you guys around the indoors garden, have I? Well, okay, the um, arid manor has a, you know, a greenhouse. And as you go into the greenhouse, you can see that you're greeted by this amazing tree. And this tree actually extends two different levels. And in fact, if you take a look out through here, out through this bedroom window, I think this is in fact um, Amethyst's bedroom, you can quite easily see into the greenhouse down here. And I made it so that there's so many windows around here that you don't need any natural lighting. Or unnatural lighting, should I say. Sure, I have, like, little lights hidden down here, but that's about it. Also, Kaylee, you have... Excuse me. You have things that you can plant. So let's go and plant them. Bluebells, let's go and... Move one... What? Purchase seeds? No, I don't want to purchase seeds. Move the bluebell down to... Hello? I don't want to purchase seeds. What do you not understand about that? Let's do that. Let's just drag them out of the inventory. Um, grapes don't grow into trees, do they? I'm pretty sure they don't grow into trees. The reason why I'm asking, I don't want to grow a tree right next to a wall. That's just stupid. I say it as there's a tree that's fairly close to two different walls. But there's more than enough space around here. In fact, it's Silver, where are you? You are over here. You want to research on the computer, get to know Charles, and schedule a date. Let's go over to here, let's go and do friendly, let's go and get to know. Which is, you know, rather odd considering these guys have known each other since pretty much the day of their birth. Get to know. And that begs the question, who's older out of all of these? 
Now, okay, I'll tell you guys, I have the game, like, the aging pause for my sims. So that's why it seemed like they're never going to age. I, I don't know. I'll decide on whether I'm going to let them age at a later point. For right now, I'm content with these guys as they are. So, Silver ages up in 11 days. Charles ages up in 11 days. And I can't check Amethyst. But assuming that Kaylee also ages up in 11 days, I kind of think that Amethyst also... Wait, did I just say level up in 11 days? Oh my god. <laughs> That's how you get better at The Sims, guys. You have to have your Sims age up. You gain so many levels that way, dude. I'm just kidding. Um... Let's also finally go and compliment you, heartfelt compliment, and then let's go and ask on a date, ask Kaylee and Liss out on a date. Okay guys, that is going to be it. I am going to end the episode here, and then I'm going to continue the next episode when the date happens, or at the start of the date. So I bid you guys adieu, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I will see you guys next time. Take care.